Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Aries for love and relationship for the month of June Here is money if you are opening up or more open to get married, have a wife, have a husband. And I guess here you have been really closed off about it like before in the past. And now I get here that you are committed or your heart is committed to someone, but you are not really understanding the other person in your life. The other person I get here, they want to work on their body, their uh, like you know, physical um, it seems to be that they see the light about you and them to be together, but they cannot really tell if there is other people, other competitions, other people in the picture. They are suffering an ache or suffer of being... They don't believe that they are the only one. They feel like there are other competitions, other people in the picture. They want you to be really isolating other people. Like, you might really uh, told uh, this person that, uh, okay, I have someone else in my life, I'm breaking up with them, and they are like, now what? What are you waiting for? Since you are committed to me and you are with me, why you are still with the other person? Mostly, it's not the other person in your life, like, and you feel that I'm not really, like, uh, doing any step forward in my life, it's just because you want to uh, uh, work on your financial like the financial situation um, you want to get ahead financially you want to bring the best of your business best of your money at this current time and I get here that you are relying on a source of income or somebody to give you or hand you this money or something to do with your financial situation like I could be really working on, in a company waiting on that company to be really giving me my money or it could be inheritance, or it could be like, you know, something alone. Um, it's, well, check it out. You don't have to really just to wait because um, people could be really having some really issues or problems not focusing because you are not really the only one. So you need to remind them. Anyway, you see that where is your main issue and ob obstacle with a certain person this is another person we are talking about that you want to let go your emotions and feeling from that person but you feel sympathy for the other person that you are going to leave because i see you committing yourself to someone the other person you are not really committed to and you want to let them go but you haven't made that decision yet and every time you want to do that you just find it a problem or an issue. It's not e easy to let go. And it's giving you some fears and insecurities there. You're not really letting go of the other person because you're afraid that you let them go and they meet someone else. Well, you met someone else already, but uh, let them go. Why? Why you want to trap them? Live and let live. It's really better. Okay. There is a very compassionate person around you. That person like no care for you, for your health, your safety. And they feel with you like no really very much. You are committed to that person already and you want really to go along the run with them. This person could be like no really an air sign. An air sign person. There is water sign also. Fire sign. So I cannot really tell you which one. 
but it looks to me that you know you know your person yourself. You have really more confidence in yourself this month, and you can really like you know just be. I don't care. People stay with me, stay. They come to me, they come. I'm not really looking after someone to come to me, try to work so hard for it. I've done really enough, and that's it. The other person keep ha really having problems with you, jealousy, control issue. Come after them, try to prove yourself, and and you're like, I'm done. I, I don't really want to deal with this anymore. I'm really confident in myself enough. Whoever want to be in a relationship with me, they can, if I want them. But to run after them and beg them, I'm not doing it. You know someone from your past, past relationship, like in the very past, and I get here, you find yourself really very happy with that person, like you, know, you are on the same level. That's the person you committed to right now. And it looks to me that they are the only one who understand you. It could be a Virgo person, it could be a Gemini person also. But I get here that there is an, yeah, an air, air sign person, yeah. There is an earth sign person that they are taking really very long to come back to you, but you meant to be together also. Earth. Earth as Virgo, Capricorn. Hmm. Or a Taurus. Someone from your past is really re-entering your life again, coming in the picture, and yet you have been really waiting for that person forever. And I can hear you are no longer waiting this person in, uh, with you right now as you are headed into marriage. There is a marriage going to happen, but you want to wait on the marriage for a certain time until you approve your money. Many of you are getting married in a short time, even if you think you're going to delay it till next year. No, it's going to happen either in a few months or a few weeks. So it sounds to be that whatever you have been really waiting for is coming in your grasp. It could be money situation though. You have confidence enough like, you know, to be really like, you know, committing and settling down. Some of you are really having problem or an issue with the person and I see you like you know, really having a hard time letting them go. But it looks to me that you cannot let them go, no matter what. Yeah. so much luck, money situation, a new love, a new confidence in you. You are stronger. You are not weak anymore. You believe in yourself. You are not really sitting there waiting on someone to tell you, hey, or whatever. I can hear you reach your goal. You do whatever you want, which is a good thing. There is a Libra person here that they have been really not being honest or serious with you. It's not necessarily a Libra, it could be a Gemini, Aquarius also. And I get here, this person need your help, need your attention, need your financial, like, you know, really help also. Um, they are mad and angry because you don't want to give them any attention. And I get here that you are disappointed with an air sign. They are not your direction and you're going to ignore them. That's you. This person wants to make a new business. They want you to renew the relationship, to come to them, to help them with something, offer you 
offer you work or money or something to for you it's like they sense that you are leaving that's the other person you want to leave they sense you are leaving and they are giving you business like you not know, to work with them for you to stay so this is very tricky so you need to pay attention to that yeah you are like, nope, you're confusing me, I'm confused about you, I'm not really sure about you, I'm going to go ahead and walk away, and you are pushing them away. So it's not going to work with them. Well, dear Aries, I hope you enjoy your uh, life uh, the way you are setting it up, because it seems to be what you are setting up for your future is going to make you extremely happy and fortunate in money too. So you are on the right direction, don't worry. No matter what other people try to fill in your head all of this nonsense and tell you like no real stuff about you that is not really right, don't believe it and like just go on because you know what you are doing, you know what you believe in yourself and don't let them block you with emotions and, and all of this stuff, you know, just really be strong and push through these restrictions and because I see you're much happier and confident here. And lucky, it looks to me that, you know, really this month is going to be very good for you. Best of luck for you, dear Aries. I hope you enjoy the reading. And if you need a private reading, please contact me. And the link for my website is below this, vi this video, mysticalaziza.com. After you click on reading prices, please purchase your reading. Then give me a call. And my phone number is listed on my website. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.